Hello everyone, this is Horus from Arc Rage. In this video series, I'm gonna take you through all the custom quests. So actually, the custom quests start from chapter 100 to 104. So I'm gonna take you through all of them, one video by another. So please keep watching all the series I'm gonna do in this channel. And I hope you enjoy. So yeah guys, let's start from chapter 100. So everyone, first quest says, go to Golden Runes and find Sko... So we're gonna find Sko... Uh, Urla. So let's take a board to there. You also may ask a donation if someone can board you. I usually do this. And everyone helps here. So yeah, very nice people. So we're gonna open the board and we're gonna set our way to there. Perfect. Once you're there, you will find the Sko... Urla. Right here. So we're gonna talk to her. She will say greeting and blah blah blah. So we're gonna just skip it and take our quest. You always can open the quest log and read what it wants. So it wants us to kill Goldwing Harpy, 30 of them. So we're gonna open the map and see that's right there. So perfect. We're gonna just mark it and we're gonna walk the walk, bro. We're gonna move all the way to there. So, yep. Let's. Get our horse out and right toward there. We're gonna start killing the little Harby mobs. So get your arrow or whatever build you're using and start killing. I don't know about you guys, but it's my first time using the Primeval build, so yeah, I don't know the comps. I will just go and spam all the keys. Let's kill the last one. Okay. So, alright, guys. Once we're done, we have to head back to this guy. So, yep. So, yeah, guys, maybe take a board for a shortcut and go there. All right, guys, once we're here, we're going to go to Scout. Hello, Scout. And we're going to return the quests. Awesome. That's great, everyone. That's great. So, quest completed. And we got what we got here. Straight letter. Okay. That's a letter we want to read. So, uh, you can go there to chapter 100 and you'll see Scout Alter saying the local residents have already heard of a famous hero and have presented a gift in return they are really grateful to you. By the way, here's a letter for you. So, they gave me a letter. I said, who is the sender? Scout said, oh, I don't know, open it. So, they give us a gift which is the ship for three days and also give us a letter that we read to continue the uh, quest. So yeah, that's awesome. We can open the litter. So we open the litter and we got two items. Okay, a mystic litter. Who can be the cinder? So if you are free, you can read all of that. I'll just give it for the sake of the video. I don't want it to be so long. So yeah, this map we should go to continue our quest. So we're gonna right click it. It will say, new quest, mysterious litter. If you open the quest log by pressing the L button, you will see the mysterious litter. Quest completed, you just need to go there to return it. We're there, Frederick Island. Amazing. So, actually, you can go there by going to Hedmar and taking your free boat to there. Or from here, Yanistir, you can do so. And also from here, from Sol's Reed to there. There is a say, says all roads lead to Roma. So yeah, everyone, all roads lead to uh, Frederick Isle. So, yep, I'm gonna go to Soul Reed and uh, from there to Frederick, I believe. So yeah, yeah, let's go. Let's do it. So yeah, everyone, you're gonna go to Soul Reed and maybe move a bit toward the water. And you're gonna go right straight to Frederick Isle. I'm gonna just spawn my ship in front of me, open in a world gate, and yep, hello, shabby shabby. Uh, okay, okay, why, what, what is, hello? What, okay, now it's working good. <laughs> that was weird. So, yep, we're gonna take our lovely adventurer ship to there. So, yeah, everyone, I'm gonna just let it go from here to there, and see you when I'm there. Alright everyone, once we are here at the Frederick Isle, uh, <clears throat> um, my ship dying for some reason. So yeah, my ship don't get close to the Isle, just uh, not, not good for your ship. So yep, 
once we're here, we're gonna go down to the aisle. We're gonna take our mount. And we're gonna run toward the center to return our quest. Yeah, also so this a man your ship. So yeah, once you're here, you're gonna talk to Blue Barrel. And take the quest key, take another, return the quest, take another quest. And you're good to go. Now to the next stage. Alright everyone, once you finish with this quest, you will have uh, four arcane warning sign. Alright, so if we open the quest and navigate to the thir third quest here, it says place for signs on the island. So if we open the quest and see here in the uh, third quest, it says place for signs on the island. Okay guys, so we're gonna go to th uh, through the island and place signs. Uh, actually, you can just go to one island and place all the sign right there so that's what i'm gonna do i will head back to salt Reed and from there we'll go to this little island and place our sign so yep let's head to salt Reed. we're gonna just rotate a little bit and move toward this lovely island yep we are close is a munch up no don't get destroyed i don't have sands shrimp so we're gonna go there guys once you were here on the shipwreck, you're gonna go to this warning sign and you're gonna just press F. And that's it. You just placed your first sign of the warning signs. So we need to wait here until it's gone and we're gonna place another one. So yeah, everyone, once it's completed, we're gonna check the map and see that we need to return it to somewhere here. So we're gonna take our mount and ride toward there. And we will find Lucius. Hello, Lucius. Been a long time, my dude. So, you're gonna talk to Lucius. And he will say a lot of things. You need to read them carefully. And he will give you another quest. So, the quest says find the ghost ship. That's easy. You need just to find a ghost ship. You're gonna take your boat and have a little trip to there until you find the ghost ship. So yeah guys, you need to go there no matter if you found the ship or not, it will be marked as completed once you get here, to this point. So as you guys saw, we didn't find any ghost ship here, but it did mark as completed. So you don't worry about finding a ghost ship or not. Now we done it. Now we done our first quest. Now we need to go to Diamond Shores in the Mistong area. So you want to go to Riona and talk to her. Riona, not that guy. <laughs> So we gotta talk to her and take our quest. So yep. So yeah guys, for the fifth quest, you need a GR, which is Crimson Rift. So to know the time of the GR or uh, Crimson Rift, you actually can go and check the website. I'm gonna link it down in the description. So if you want to know when GR starts and everything, I will link this website under the description. So once you're here in the website, all we want is the Crimson Rift, which is a GR. So here it will happen in 2 hours and 41 minutes for me. So in that time I will record the 5th quest for you guys. So yeah, you can also see the other times if you are busy or something. You can do it any of these times. To sync it with your time zone, you can just enable this one. So if you are in East, you will find the quest happened in Yanistir. Which is this part of the map. I believe you guys are familiar with Yanistir right here. If you are a West player, you will go to Cindermore Stone and it will be right in the GR area, which is, I believe, around this area. Lovely, everyone. Once we are in the GR area, we will do the fifth quest, which is defeat Nightmare Crushers. Here is the first wave, which is not a Crushers, normal Nightmares, we can just kill them. And then when the Crushers spawn, we're just gonna kill 50 of them. Ba -boom -ba -bam. And for some reason, the Nightmare serve actually count as a Crusher, so we're gonna kill the last one of them to get my quest completed. And lovely, it's completed now. Now we're gonna go help them. After GR is over, you want to go and teleport to the Diamond Shores, the Mistong area. And you want to find the lovely Tirasus. Crimson Watch Tirasus. And you want to talk and choose one of the rewards. So I will go with the 
Weapon Regret Scrolls, maybe. And that's it. Fifth quest completed. And in the next video, I will show you from the sixth quest to the tenth one. Keep watching the series and thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. This was Horus from Ark Rage.